Hi guys, welcome back to another video. I'm going to be showing you how to jailbreak a third generation iPod Touch with Red Snow. We have this linked in the description down below. What you want to do is open it. It's jailbreak. It's going to prepare it. By modifying a backup. We're just going to restore. And then when it reboots, it is going to show the Apple logo. And then it may take a little while to boot, depending on your iPod. And then it's going to do the boot. Like install it in your firmware. It's going to be restoring the backup. Now, there's two methods to do this. You can do the backup method or the traditional method where it's just jailbreak it's, it jailbreaks while in DFE mode. But I recommend this one, it's way faster. You do lose all your music and stuff. So I would say do this on a fresh install. And this is what you see when it does work. It did work the first time. I would recommend this for the third gen, mainly because I've had issues with the DFU RAM disk, where it would sometimes just freeze up. So you're just gonna wanna wait till the Cydia thing exits and completes, and then we'll be back. And then when it finishes, you're just going to go back to Cydia, say user, press done. And then it, this is the older version, so we will have to do an upgrade. And then the next video on, it'll, on this iPod will be showing you how to get the YouTube app working, which we go in depth in the packets and not the packets, the um, API keys and all that. So now it's just going to show you all this. Wait for this to save. You want to wait to press reloading data, press return Cydia, complete upgrade, which I like to do just to get things out of the way. And then when we get back, should be done. I'm doing this all by hand actually, so it's kind of hard manning the camera with one hand and then I think I don't know if I'm muffling the microphone or anything. Which I also think it uses the back microphone too. I was just gonna repair everything. I was just done doing downloading all that stuff, which is maybe the end part for this. This one is a really quick thing because all it just does is modify a backup instead of doing the whole RAM disk going from there. Let's press restart springboard. Once you hear that charge sound, it's going to come back. And open Cydia again, and then if 
think you're done. Come back when it's done loading. And that's it. You just installed Cydia on a third, gen gen third generation iPod using the backup method. But you do lose your songs, your music, but you can do the RAM disk, but it has a chance of failing. So this is why I'm going to stick with the uh, RAM disk. Well, not the RAM disk, the backup method, also because it's faster. And this is a fresher store, so it makes it easier. But if you're the kind of person who has music on their phone or iPod and doesn't want to lose all that, I'd say the RAM disk is for you. And well, thanks for watching. Comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.